do a bit better today. Yeah, it, I was actually a little surprised. Uh, on Missed how it. Yeah, just wide. A, li a little surprised on uh, how uh, easy it was for Chung Wei to, to win in, in Paris. Uh, I think um, Chao Chen Chen has uh, improved a lot. And, yes. um, and um, it's interesting to see whether it makes any difference that we're playing in a very, very big hole here in uh, Fuzhou compared to the much smaller uh, Stade de Pierre de Coubertin in, in Paris. Mm. Um, just explain well, that a little bit more. How would how well, would that be different for the players then? Um, normally, w with the smaller stadiums, it, it favours the uh, attacking players or the players that play a very precise, very accurate game. Uh, whereas the the bigger stadiums, it's a little bit difficult to to get the timing right, especially in the earlier rounds of the tournament. Well, and, and that's why it's a little bit harder for the more so attacking so players to to get it well, oh. their game going in the first rounds. But uh, then again. Um, we know that uh, both these two players can definitely attack. Yeah. Oh yes, that's nice. Solo solo. Three, it's interesting you say about Chao Tian Chen and his improvement. The last four Super Series, he's been in at least a uh -huh. semi-final uh -huh. of all four. Yeah. And I can remember chatting to him earlier in the year. Oh, that's a light of the neutral And he was telling me that uh, he had listened to some of our commentaries. And we, were, we had been a little critical of him taking the shuttle a bit late at the yeah. net. And he said that he's really tried to work on that. He's been talking to his coach. He's been working on other aspects of his game. And of course, we're acutely aware he, Five, by his oh. standards, had a, uh, a disastrous world championships. He was seeded, lost in the first round. But I think so many players could learn from him because he's been prepared to work on his game. In the interim period, you take a step backwards before the possibility of taking three, so so two, three, or so maybe even four five. steps further forward. And yeah. he has improved. Yeah, and that's what is what so many players find hard, that when you have to make major changes in, y in your game you have to accept a decrease in, in form yeah uh, it's simply natural but if you try to do something that you haven't done earlier then, then you're not very good at it in the beginning oh yes well i have to say so that i so thought lee chong way in sorry. paris was uh, the lee chong way of old we've seen him in recent tournaments he's it's been well documented. He's had a crisis in confidence by losing in in the qualifying in Korea. You know that th that's one result. You don't you don't become a bad player overnight. He's still a, a great badminton player. And I I think actually it's exactly the case that we just discussed with uh, with Chao that that he was making uh, changes in his his uh, game. And I think the same goes for for Lee Chung Wei. And that's why it's so great to see him back uh, to winning ways in in Paris. Um, of course, being perhaps the uh, oh, look at that! Yeah, great play. Oh, the clear is just long. So yeah, sorry to interrupt Four, you, Steve. Six. Yeah, um, he's definitely the best um, bid for a Malaysian medal at, at the Olympics, and um, and uh, of course, there's a lot of people uh, interested in, in him doing well and, and sometimes that can create some confusion mm. and certainly pressure yeah this is a good rally oh good body smash Overdone it. Yeah. Yeah. Solo, solo. Solo, four. And this is perhaps one of the situations where Cho um, still um, can improve a little bit. Um, so, Cho, if you're listening. Uh <laughs> <laughs> um, oh, he'll listen back, all right. <laughs> later on, um, 
when, when, when the rallies get long, um, in, in the game that is not clearly a, a defensive uh, game for, for Chao or clearly an offensive game for him, then how do you actually um, uh, conduct yourself in, in that situation? The patience needed, the small um, changes in, in uh, shot placement in order to create an opportunity for yourself. And mm. that's, that's um, something that takes experience to, to figure that out. Yeah. Yeah, that's uh, well played. Yeah. I so oh. important for singles players to use that cross smash from their forehand side in order to sort of uh, keep the opponents guessing. It's not so easy because you open up all your backhand side if the opponent reaches that smash. Mm. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Nine, four. And I'm really looking forward to see Lee Chung Wei in this tournament because I'm watching his shot quality. Um, I've criticized him earlier for making some, some loose shots that he can get away with or he normally could get away with, but um, he needs definitely needs to improve on that. And I, I think he has done that. I thought that the turning points was his second round match 